What's up? This is HD News Tech here. So, this video is going to be about gene therapy that is possibly coming to the markets for a certain company who is Bob Martin and has finally, if they get this approved in six months with the FDA, it would be the most expensive drug uh, for treatment and it will replace the, the broken gene I was born with basically. It would just have a normal copy transferred from a, you know, from a virus and it's apparently really safe. 150 plus people and uh, there's no side effects or something like that. It just, they just have clotting activity. Good, in fact, perfect clotting activity. In fact, they were able to get down their studies where they could get 95% off of the infusion. So it's like a drop in that. But in the past, it always had trouble where it would eventually wear off and then they would go back where they were with the bleeding illness and, uh, Hopefully, I don't have to have it more than once. Wherever it is, it does occur, that it does come. But the, the cost is, they're respecting the patient to pay $3 million. You know, all of us don't have that money. None of us do around here in the U.S. And um, the being most expensive drug if it's approved, it's just a virus with enzymes. So you actually edit, I guess, the gene just put it back in like it should be. And... Uh, I'm hoping this new memory card that I just put in it will fix this issue I got. I'm hoping it's not the camera, but for some reason my Mac is not liking it and it was slowing down. The thing needs to be replaced when I can't afford it, so um, it's currently not stable, so I went to get medicine and got paid today and um, bought a couple masks. Reusable now, bought one box of non reusable masks just to wear each day. Had to replace them every 12 hours or so, or every like, halfway through the shift, and then replace it, and then with another new one. So, yeah, detergent, things like that. So, so this is a sand disc. It's one of those ones I trust. The Walmart one, I don't know if it's going to work or not, but every time I plug it into the USB, it will corrupt the file. And I had trouble with the uh, video in the last clip, and uh, it did not have right from this brightness like it does right now. It was completely dark, and uh, nothing would work on the Mac if they do editing. And it's getting to the point where the hardware is just not there anymore. It's an old iMac, and apparently it's just time at the end of its days. And I'm hoping I can get this footage uploaded to YouTube without an issue, but. I just hope it doesn't get corrupted because for some reason I quick time player cannot open this file. Like, why are you telling me that? Why? I don't need to know why. So, um, I'm hoping it works. So, if you need to check go ahead and subscribe below and like. As well, I'll share this video online as you want. As well as push that bell notification button so you never miss out on the video upload. I do have limited upload times when I can upload. I work a certain amount of hours a week. I don't always have perfect days off to upload to you guys for you guys to watch on YouTube. There are times when my parents are here and I can't uh, do the footage there when they're there and um, different things like that. And right now I can do it, but every every other day maybe. And I will have surgery the second week of August, so I will be out. I'll have a tooth removed off of that too. I went to a dentist tonight, today, as you see if I can have this other tooth up there crowned and hopefully fixed. It's kind of feeling like it may not be able to be saved, but I don't know. I never had a tooth crown, so I was like new to it. So, hopefully good. I've been using mouthwash to wash it all out, really high quality. Uh, press, you know. Without that call, of course, because the last time I used that, I that call, it was like, I had a bleed, and it was like killing 12, it was like killing 13 or so, it was in the summertime. I used one of those um, mouthwash, I bought those back in the day, in May, or I think in the summer of that year, and I did have a bleed, apparently. And the side meat controlled it within three days, which was another way to elevate the level of the factor in the blood, make it make the blood clot, basically. And um, I did have that pain again. Like it was kind of like flaring up when I was camping, but I had the medicine just to cover it, the newer one, which took care of it within an hour or less. 
So uh, that call free one works, so I'm sticking to that. I don't need other kind of bleeds, because apparently it tears up my gums or something and causes them to bleed, and I don't need that. I guess they're kind of brittle and not the strongest, so. Thankfully, there's a lot of alcohol free uh, mouthwash, so I don't have to worry. <laughs> it's not the Walmart brand, I know that, but it ha offers, you know, whitening and building up the enamel and all that, and it's not cheap, like five bucks or so, but you know, it's worth it. Wash for a minute, it's kind of intense. I'm like, I don't really want to squish it that long, but I'm trying to do it now more often. So, um, thanks for watching. See you.